has been instrumental in furthering our understanding of four life trans including its role in strengthening the immune system. Shane provides continual support to other four life departments through his work in research and development. Prior to four life, Shane worked as a debt analyst at a genetics company that evaluated the hereditary risk factors for breast and Now please welcome to the stage Senior Director of Product Development, Shane Leffler. How are you for life? <laughs> I'm excited to be here. So before we get started, do we need to try the uh, Dr. Bennett's trick? Everyone stand up so you can uh, make sure you're awake. Because mine's going to be a little bit technical. Everyone stand up. Stretch. Take a poll real quick. 
For those of you that um, have been participating, when is the best time to take transfer factor plus A in the morning, B at night, C when you're healthy, D when you're not feeling that fantastic, or E daily? Any of them, right? You're right, so daily. That's the, uh, that's the optimal answer. You can take it whenever you want, as long as you take it on a consistent basis. The ingredients have that benefit of helping your immune system continue on a, on a daily process. So to give you a sneak peek at the presentation, uh, we're going to uh, uh, going to understand the importance of the innate immune system function and how the plus of the cortical blend activates them. So you're going to follow this. Sorry, I got ahead of myself. You're going to follow this little light bulb that helps you uh, as you go throughout my presentation uh, to know when I'm talking about the innate immune system. And you also, if you, I will also talk about the importance of the acquired or the adaptive immune system and how transfer factors can interact and educate that portion of our immune system. So then we'll, uh, let me back up, sorry. Not that far. Then we'll, then we'll look at how these two systems work together. And you'll follow this little guy uh, with these uh, two puzzle pieces that show how, how the innate side and the adaptive side have the ability to work together. So what are the components of the, of the cortical blend? So Transfactor Plus contains transfer factors, which are an array of proteins that encodes mother's immune memory, and, pre and they're present in claw sugar and chicken egg yolk, and they are active when you consume them. The cortical blend is a blend of plant-based mushroom immune modulators. Keep going. And then also, uh, it contains many types of beta glucans as well as mannins. So I will, we're a little bit uh, off on that. There we go. So the Cortland blend, as I said, contains these kind of three or four different pieces. There's a blend, a, a blend of, of immune modulators, different types of beta glucans from whether it be baker's yeast or whether it be oat, but also. Um, and also, we're going to keep going. It also contains magnets from aloe and phytosterols, base testosterone, and phytic acid, which is IP6, which is a good source of inositol. And lastly, it contains a zinc chelate for a great source of zinc. So while the immune response is complex and involved, we want to focus on two main arms. First, our innate response is our primary response. Both, this is both critical and early in development. And this is the pre-programmed pre part of your immune system. And then second, the adaptive or secondary response. It is the system that revolves, resolves cellular conflict and removes damaged cells. Typically this system puts into those, those into memory so as to remember them for future reference. The cortisol tra and transfer factors work in synergy to, uh, to keep us healthy and strong. So you can see how both components of TF Plus have that the ability to help shrink the immune system on multiple ways. So let's talk about some of these plus ingredients. So first of all, let's start, let's talk about the mushrooms in the, uh, the product. First, let's talk about shiitake mushroom. It goes by the Latin name of Lentus pedonis. The cool thing about mushrooms is that there's evidence of them in our diets as far back as 9000 BC and in many ancient cultures around the world. Shiitake mushrooms are native to East Asia and are a delicious edible mushroom, as long as it's in the right food, right? In the image to the right, you'll see an electron microscope. Okay, 
So hold on one second. So in TF Plus, there are four different mushrooms that we have combined to provide a synergistic benefit to, to Transfectin Plus. So first of all, let's talk about shiitake. There we go. So in the right, you see an electron microscope view of a CD8 cells interacting. So these are two cells that interact with each other. You can kind of see how, how the two are talking to one another. In 2006, Kukula showed that shiitake mushrooms improve the immune responses, both innate and adapted, by showing that the cytokine increases in CD8 T cells in macrophages. So you kind of see, as those, um, as they said shiitake mushrooms, you saw this increase in the responsiveness of the immune system. The Taki mushrooms are, are edible and, and are native to Japan. In the Journal of Agriculture and Food Chemistry in 2013, Sal and his colleagues showed that the addition of a Taki mushroom extract increased interferon from natural killer cells and in turn increased bone marrow and dendritic cells by toll receptors. Oops, I went too far. The main, main, main benefit you're getting here is that all these mushrooms are having an effect on the immune system in, in different ways. Agaricus, now this is an amazing mushroom found in native to Brazil and has many benefits. In 2004, Kasai showed that agaricus induces IL-12, which is a cytokine, a critical regulator of the cellular immune response in monocytes. When consumed orally, Agaricus mushrooms have been shown to enhance natural killer cell function, and as shown by Enel consuming these mushrooms, the Agaricus mushrooms, help to rebalance the immune system response after only 10 days. Pretty, pretty amazing ingredients. Let's talk a little bit about cordyceps. They're native to Nepal and extensively utilized in traditional Chinese medicine. And who in, in 2007 showed that the presence of Cordyceps improve the innate immune cell ability to perform its functions. And again in 1986, Wyckoff showed that by taking cordyceps, that once challenged, different responses follow, like an increase in TNF alpha if the immune system is threatened. And yet, if not threatened, cordyceps balances the cell mediated immune response. So that's pretty tricky that you have an ingredient that, in the presence of a threat, can actually respond in one way. When it's not there, it has a different effect. So some of the other ingredients in TF Plus, they're not mushrooms. Let's talk about aloe for just a minute. This amazing plant helps the inside of the body as much as it helps sunburns on the outside. Magnets are an active component, and an aloe vera have been shown to improve the recognition of dendritic cells in bone marrow. Magnets have acted as an adjuvant or an enhancer when taken with an immune challenge. Wobble in 1992 observed that ACE meds increased the number and performance of cytotoxic T cells by 50% compared to giving just the antigen alone. So by adding aloe, they actually saw a greater response. The immune system was able to, uh, to actually interact more. So let's talk about zinc. It's an amazing mineral. It's a cofactor for many cellular processes and pathways and plays a crucial role in many of our systems. The recommended daily dietary intake for zinc is 15 milligrams per day. And in TF Plus, you get 10 milligrams if you take two capsules or if you take three tablets. I know it gets a little confusing now. Here you can see the amount of zinc in a number of different items, like beef, tenderloin, shrimp, green peas, and mushrooms. Luckily, I just ate, otherwise I'd be really getting really hungry. Quite often, research on vitamins and minerals looks at the reduction of the vitamin or mineral to show the importance of it in our diets. For instance, these articles show that reduction in zinc resulted in the shrinkage of the thymus and the reduction in native or new T cells and also decrease in natural killer cell activity. So you can see that zinc plays a very important role. It's needed for the proper growth and maintenance of the human body plays a very, very unique um, uh, process within our bodies. It's found in several systems and biological reactions, and it is needed for immune function, but also wound healing, blood clotting,
thyroid function, and much, much more. We have some amazing ingredients in this product. I hope you can see that Transfer Factor Plus provides us with the balanced and powerful companion to our immune system by interacting and strengthening our innate and acquired immune responses, which can lead to a healthy and strong immune system. I want to thank, thank you so very much for your time as we've talked about Transfer Factor Plus. I hope you have the opportunity to try the new chewable product and then give me some feedback as to what you like about it.